Yo, what's going on everybody? I'm doing a preview discussion for One Piece episode 729 and it turns out that next episode Luffy is going to be out of it and it's going to take 10 minutes for Haki to come back and Sabo is going in against Burgess and with all these details going on I'm pretty much just going to uh, talk about my predictions of what's going to happen next episode for all you anime viewers. So first of all it turns out that Doflamingo is just some sort of indestructible motherfucker because he will not go down <laughs> like his body was imprinted on the palace walls and he still stood up and the birdcage is still shrinking like it's getting smaller and now we have Luffy knocked out so the bad news is is that you know now we have to protect Luffy for 10 minutes because not only Doflamingo is going after him Burgess is going after him the good news is is that we have Sabo on our side and the thing is, even though Sabo has his own agenda right now, he will not let down the opportunity to pretty much protect his brother. And he pretty much made a promise that, hey, I'm going to protect Luffy no matter what. So will it be a possibility that we will see Sabo versus Burgess and Doflamingo? I mean, that would be cool if he like double team against both of them because like even though that would be like a formidable match and all, I'm pretty sure Sabo can hold his own, you know. So... To see that, that'll be pretty cool. So uh, a lot of predictions going on right now. And the other thing is, you know, what exactly are they going to do about Luffy? How will they keep him away from Doflamingo? And will he go back into the battle to uh, use Gear Force and pretty much knock him out? Because I'm pretty sure Doflamingo has to be fatigued in some sort of way. And it seems like the sit-ins are up for a battle. So I don't know if One Piece is probably going to go to that gruesome route of uh, Doflamingo just slaughtering the citizens just left and right to get to uh, Luffy. Or, you know, we see the announcer, Gats, he's carrying Luffy on his back. So will Gats, you know, meet his end or something like that? Because uh, One Piece characters, you know, they don't really die so easily. So what exactly will happen? You know, this is obviously the conclusion of the Dressrosa arc. So... I really want to see some crazy stuff happen and I honestly want to see Sabo put the hand put those hands on Burgess because you know I've been wanting to see his ass get kicked anybody in the Blackbeard crew I want to see that ass get kicked so a lot of crazy stuff coming for next episode it's exciting so far and in the manga I remember this being an exciting part so a lot of good stuff coming but yeah that's my prediction uh tell me what you guys think like this video if you uh, like anything about it and of course subscribe if you guys want to and I catch you guys around later for that next episode of One Piece I'll be reviewing. Alright guys, peace. Yo, what's going on everybody? I'm doing a preview discussion for One Piece episode 729 and it turns out that next episode Luffy is going to be out of it and it's going to take 10 minutes for Haki to come back and Sabo is going in against Burgess and with all these details going on I'm pretty much just going to uh, talk about my predictions of what's going to happen next episode for all you anime viewers. So first of all, it turns out that Doflamingo is just some sort of indestructible motherfucker, right? To get to uh, Luffy or, you know, we see the announcer Gats, he's carrying Luffy on his back. So will Gats, you know, meet his end or something like that? Because uh, One Piece characters, you know, they don't really die so easily so what exactly will happen you know this is obviously the conclusion of the Dressrosa arc so I really want to see some crazy stuff happen and I honestly want to see Sabo put the hand put those hands on bulls so uh a lot of predictions going on right now and the other thing is you know what exactly are they going to do about Luffy how will they keep him away from Doflamingo and will he go back into the battle to uh, use Gear Force and pretty much knock him out? Because I'm pretty sure Doflamingo has to be fatigued in some sort of way. And it seems like the sit-ins are up for a battle. So I don't know if One Piece is probably going to go to that gruesome route of uh, Doflamingo just slaughtering the citizens. Just left Sabo has his own agenda right now. He will not let down the opportunity to pretty much protect his brother and he pretty much made a promise that hey i'm gonna protect luffy no matter what so will it be a possibility that we will see sabo versus burgess and doflamingo i mean that'd be cool if he like double team against both of them because like even though that'd be like a formidable match and all i'm pretty sure sabo can hold his own you know so to see that that'll be pretty quicker because he will not go down <laughs> Like his body was imprinted on the palace walls and he still stood up and the birdcage is still shrinking. Like it's getting smaller and now we have Luffy knocked out. So the bad news is, is that, you know, now we have to protect Luffy for 10 minutes because not only Doflamingo is going after him, Burgess is going after him. The good news is, is that we have Sabo on our side. And the thing is, even though 